Happy morning. Happy Monday morning. I am a little bit worn out right now. I just got done working out. Um, I did the 20 minutes of level one on Julian Michael's 30 day shred and went for an almost 16 minute jog, which is probably my slowest that I've done, but I <clears throat> haven't worked out since last Monday. I'm I'm still kind of recovering from a cold slash allergies type of mess um, that I haven't liked. And for some reason on Mondays, I absolutely force myself to work out, even if I'm not feeling too great. Um, just because, I don't know, it's like the beginning of a new week because I don't work out on Sundays. Uh, there's not enough time with church. And then we uh, got to go over to a friend's house last night. Um, but I like working out in the mornings. And if I can't do it in the morning, then more than likely I'm not going to. So Sundays are my free day of not having to work out. Um, yeah, so we'll see if I continue to work out this week. Hopefully I do. Um, I just need to kind of like clean out my sinuses somehow. They're not very fun right now. Um, but I just did my weigh-in as well, and I'm starting to get kind of like, starting to not believe my weigh-ins. Or while I was jogging, I was thinking, um, I think my body, like, I think God really created us, our bodies, to want to be healthy. And I think when we start getting healthy, our bodies just continue to go on that path and want to be healthy. And so, I said, I only worked out last Monday, and there have been a couple of days where I didn't count my points very well. Um, but I think there were some days that I didn't eat all my points because I wasn't feeling well. And I lost a pound and a half this last week, which totally shocked me with how little I worked out. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. I think, like, I keep on, like, thinking of, like, the biggest loser when, like, sometimes if somebody hits a plateau, then the trainers will have them work out less and up their calories a little bit to kind of throw their body off. Um, so their body's, like, constantly guessing and doesn't go into starvation mode or whatever and will continue to lose the weight. And I think I've been really good, not on purpose, at doing that, of, like, bouncing my points and my exercise or something. Well, this was the first time that my exercise hasn't been constant. But every day, I'm kind of, I go to a different point, kind of, um, at what I end at. So, I'm only point, I'm only half a pound um, away from losing 20 pounds. So that's really exciting. I'll be able to reach that next week. I better be able to reach that next week. I'm still waiting for the week where I'm like only zero pounds. Um, and I kind of feel like this is my seventh week in a row that I weighed in and have lost weight. And I'm kind of just waiting for that, like, okay, when is this going to stop? Um, but I hope it doesn't stop for a few more weeks. I think I have seven more weeks. I think I'm halfway through with my Weight Watchers, um, account. So... That's kind of, that's really exciting. Almost 20 pounds halfway through. I don't think I'm going to lose 20 pounds from this point, but, um, I don't know. If that happened, that'd be awesome, but I doubt it will happen. And Bible study last week was really good. Um, I actually even helped out one of the other ladies that was there, um, with one of her issues, and I had some scripture to give her to encourage her in her situation, and that was really exciting. Um, so I think I'm really starting to make progress on it, and I'm starting to really... It's really starting to sink in, and I'm really internalizing um, that me forgiving others is really for myself. Like, the other person has probably no clue what they've done to me internally and how much it's hurt our family and probably just living on life like, ah, no big deal, like, nothing happened. Um, and it's the only person that it's really going to hurt is me and my family. Uh, with me hanging on to my unforgiveness and anger and stuff. And I was actually talking to my friend about it last night that we were over at their house. And it was really, it was, it was really nice. To, like, she's kind of deals with the same stuff as I do. Um, and it's kind of nice to talk to somebody that's kind of in the same situation. Because I, I have gotten to the point where I'm just like, I feel like I have the right to hang on to my unforgiveness and just be angry at this person. And I totally don't. And we've been reading through the scriptures of um, how we need to forgive others so that God will be able to forgive us. Or if we're hanging on to this unforgiveness, and God's not going to be able to hear our prayers because we have all this cloudy, mucky stuff in the way. So, um, so it's really, I don't know, I really feel like I'm making progress. And I'm totally shocked that I actually lost weight this last week. Um, 
I was expecting this would be my week to do zero. Um, but it's not at all a pound and a half, almost two pounds. That's crazy. The scale, I, I weighed in like right after I had worked out. And so my body is still a little bit shaky. So the scale was kind of like going in between 160 and 161. Um, so I figured probably 160.5 is probably good. So I didn't want to go to 160 and the next week be my zero. I don't know. I usually want to tend to do, to record the higher weight that I think. Um, so then that way I'm not as disappointed the next week if I would be too. Um, I don't know. So yeah, so that's good. Um, I was really encouraged last week. Um, oh my goodness, I forgot who it was. I'll have to look at it later. Um, somebody had said that they, um, were encouraged by the video and went and worked out instead of just sitting there playing on YouTube. Um, so that was really exciting. Uh, one thing that I have been noticing that I've been telling people that's kind of humbling is that I was at the point before I started working out, I was at the point where I was so lazy and I did not want to get up off the couch if one of the kids needed something and I would just like ask for Tim to go do something and even if I was like right there, I just didn't want to have to get up and that was really sad that I had gotten to that point where I just didn't want even want to move and I had no energy and I was just a big slob on the couch. So this has been wonderful to get moving and I think that may have been part of my weight loss this last week is that I'm just feeling more energized and although I didn't work out, but I still like even around the house like I'll go do stuff or I'll move around or I'll dance with the kids and entertain them or whatever and I don't know, so I just move a lot more and it feels good. So, so if you haven't worked out in a while, just go on a walk, go enjoy some nice weather or I don't know, do something, move your body, and do something healthy. So, hope you all have a good week, and I'll talk to you next week. Bye.